testimony given during the Gun Trace Task Force case went into great detail about just how far the corruption stretched within the Baltimore City Police Department and beyond. Tuesday, spokesperson Sean Vinson said the case led to investigations of two Baltimore County police officers as well. We received allegations that were stated during the trials that these officers said that there were certain officers who may be involved in some other kind of thefts or possibly robberies. Vincent says that one officer whose name is not being released is no longer with the department as of two weeks ago as a result of an investigation. And another, Michael Woodlawn, is suspended with pay pending an ongoing investigation. During his trial, convicted city officer Mamadou Gondo testified that he stole money with Woodlawn. Woodlawn was a city officer before joining the county department in 2012. The other unnamed officer also previously served in Baltimore City. The unnamed officer he th there's an allegation that that officer was involved in something in Baltimore County. Um, the, the officer Woodland, the allegations connected to him all involved while he was employed by Baltimore City. Well, eight Baltimore City police officers were convicted during the GTTF case. Uh, federal prosecutors say the investigation is ongoing. Reporting in Baltimore County tonight, Kyrie, WBAL TV 11 News.